Good morning, everybody. We'd like to welcome you to the Student Recreation Center at George State University. My name is Alan Wilbanks. I'm the Assistant Director of Rec Services in charge of facilities. Uh, what we would like to do today is kind of give you an overview of how we clean, sanitize, and keep this building healthy. We've been here working over the last uh, month and a half to uh, detail clean the building. So we were ready to open and we are ready to go. I want to explain some of the uh, processes that we do use here at the Student Rec Center. What we've been cleaning with for almost eight plus years uh, is a product called Genion. It's an electrolyzed water that is, uh, the solution is derived from an electrolyte or mineral mixed with water and then supplying an electric charge with our moisture wand to produce the solutions you see in the buddies uh, beside me. These solutions are everything from the window cleaner to the degreasal to the sanitizer and the liminol. The liminol is a the liminol is a true quad sanitary disinfectant, but we use it just to augment the uh, the normal sanitizer and degreaser of the Genion product. We also have, as you can see, the Burel hand sanitizers. We have the Lysol uh, spray disinfectant that we, again, augment everything you see up here with those two, uh, two chemicals, basically. Uh, and we also have some pump that you can sanitize throughout the building. We are working on sourcing more product over the summer, so when we get ready to go, uh, we will be well stocked here at the Rex Center. As you can see some of the uh, equipment here in front of me, we have our backpack sprayer, another gallon sprayer that's battery powered that we can put out multiple amounts of the Genion product. We have the mister, which atomizes uh, the Genion products that we put out a fine mist. And we use this mainly in the sauna, lockers, and also uh, on our combat mat. Then right here in front of me is a Victory Electric Static Sprayer. This is a true atomizer of the Genion product. What it does is when we spray our uh, weight equipment, uh, our cardio equipment or pin loaded equipment, it envelops the, the piece of equipment in like a 3D wrap uh, to uh, clean, sanitize, and disinfect that piece of equipment with the weight and the pack. That being said, we usually uh, to do to deal with the SARS two hour, we are allowed to do 60 second dwell time, normally it's a 30 second dwell time. But unlike quad sanitary uh, disinfectants, there's no residue left. There's no wipe down. It's completely VOC free, totally healthy to the, our team behind me, and totally healthy to the patient. Uh, we will always continue to use this. We have plenty of it right now. The good thing about it is we can make as much of the disinfectant as we need because it is an on site generated unit. Very, very simple to make. It's 22 cents a gallon versus $30 a gallon in your traditional quad system. And uh, in leaving you today, uh, what we are what you to do, if you have any more questions or need any, any more information about any of the things that you see here, this, the, the process that we go through, our steps in cleaning, please go to recreation.gsu.edu for more information. Also, be on the lookout for some other drop downs on our website concerning our cleaning protocol. Thank you all and be safe and be well.